What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today, you're gonna be following me along during my day, just kind of like a day in the life kind of thing. But right now, I am on my way to a hair appointment where I am going to be getting hand-tied hair extensions. So this is something I've been wanting to do for a really long time. Unfortunately, over the years, just with age and some like long-term symptoms from COVID, I lost a lot of my hair and it got really, really thin. So I've really been wanting to just like add some volume to it and make it just look big, bouncy, luminous and beautiful for our wedding. Um, but Lance is my personal chauffeur today. <laughs> there you are. Hello! <laughs> and we are running late, of course, which is my uh, signature move with every time I have an appointment. You always gotta show up fashionably late. <laughs> yes, fashionably late, so. Therefore, all the eyes are on you when you walk in the room. Exactly, exactly. So, you guys are gonna be following me along today. I'm gonna get my hair done. We're gonna go have some lunch. Lance is gonna go pick up his suit for our wedding. So we'll just kinda see where the day takes us. Alright y'all, we are done and I have a long, beautiful, voluminous hair. Lance is coming back to pick me up, so let's see what he thinks. Okay, honest opinions. It looks like regular hair. It is, it's real hair, but it's just well, like... I get that, but I, I'm thinking that it looks just like, just longer, thicker version of your old hair. Mm-hmm, that's exactly the point. So what am I supposed to say about it? Just it looks good. <laughs> okay, great. Three hours and 45 minutes. Yeah. Better look phenomenal for that. Well, I'm beyond happy with it. Like, well, good. My hair has been- Tell everyone at home how much it costs. so a lot. How much? Was it more than you said it was? No, no, it was exactly what I said it was. The hair itself was like 500, a little under. You said 150. I did not. I said 500 and then you said, oh, I thought you were going to say like a thousand. When I told you- What was the 150? The 150 was the, co the color. Oh. Yeah worth it it is it's totally worth it so 650 jeez mm -hmm. but i only have to buy the hair one time it lasts for a whole year 3.99 mm -hmm. luscious locks i am in love well oh, good i'm very happy for you for 650 dollars you better be in love when are you gonna do this again next week no i don't have to do it till the end of may right before our wedding so it's fresh. Six hundred and fifty dollars. No, 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 no. In May I a week. No. Or a month. No, 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 no. In May I only have to pay the one fifty to get it moved up, and then she'll fix the color if need be. But the color's included. Can in I that see price. where it's sewn in? Um, uh, let's see. How does it feel? It feels a little heavy, but that's it. Like there. Do you see? I think you can feel it. The like weft right there. Right here. That is the strangest thing. Yeah, it's a little weird and it'll take a little getting used to. What but... happens if, if it like gets tugged? Like if you're brushing your hair and the brush gets stuck in it. So you, what you do is you hold it while you're brushing your hair so that your like brush doesn't go through it. So I'll like hold my hand here and hold that my hand there. That seems like a liability. I... Can you curl it, style it? Mm -hmm. Do everything. Can you put it, you wash it? Mm -hmm. Everything. When do you wash it? Whenever you want. You can wash it as often as you want. It's real hair. It's human hair. I'm gonna get into the real hair business. Mm -hmm. Sell my hair. <laughs> I shaved it. Yeah, grow it out and shave it. Or grow it out and then shave your head. And then you can sell it. <laughs> and then you can give it to me and I'll get it installed on my head. I'm gonna go throw up at 650. I swear it was only one hundred fifty. dollars No, we had that conversation. Jeez. Worth it. I put gas in my truck the other day. That was one hundred and eleven dollars. Rough. Anyway, I gotta go pick up a suit. Let's go get it. I might have to go into debt over that because your hair. We'll just sell off. I paid for my hair. Strands <laughs> of hair to pay for my suit. All right, let's go. Yeah, golf course investor right here. My southern type margarita shirt. <laughs> Is there anything else you like how the suit fits in? Yep. Is there anything that you notice about it that doesn't look right? To me, everything looks uh, looks and feels fine. Yeah, everything looks good. Okay. Are you wanting to show any ankle or sock? Uh, no, I, I like it pretty, like, laying on top of the shoe. 
What do you think of your suit? I like it a lot. Yeah, I like it a lot too. I think you look really hot. Good. <laughs> I just need brown shoes. Yeah, brown shoes. But since your hair costs six hundred and fifty dollars, at six hundred and fifty dollars, I can't spend on shoes. Oh my shoes. god! I, you did not pay for it. <laughs> you have quite the shoe budget, I would say. Quite the shoe budget. Yes, my shoes were forty-three dollars. Well, I'm a classy. Bitch. Yeah, we'll get you some nice shoes. And we'll get me a nice bourbon on the way. <laughs> yeah. I'm starving today. Yeah, I'm starving too. You left me in a car, in a hot car for three hours and 45 minutes. Yeah, I did. I'm so sorry. I did not know it was going to take that long, so yes, to be fair. I did not. If I knew, I would have told you not to take me. Uh, we should just do Air Force Ones. We should. or just custom Air Force Ones. Yeah, or Crocs. <laughs> Jeez. I mean, don't forget you have a Croc yeah. I'm all, I'll wear the tips out of some Crocs. Put it down in the comments below. Should we wear Crocs or Air Force Ones to our wedding? <laughs> Alright guys, it's time for lunch. All right, y'all, so we just had a yummy, yummy, yummy lunch at our favorite place, George's Bistro. I didn't film a lot in there just because, like, there's copyright music and stuff. But... Or as Logan likes to call it, George's Bistro and oh gives God. me all the aids mm -hmm. of my male appendage. Yeah, um, he likes to call it George's Bistro, which is hilarious because it's Bistro, but... And obscenely inaccurate. Mm -hmm. Very inaccurate. So Offens Offensively inaccurate, if you will. Yeah. Anyone. We are on our way to meet Will and his lady friend, Savannah. So y'all will, maybe if she wants to be a part of the vlog, get to meet her. And if she doesn't, then you won't get to meet her. Yeah, I will respect her wishes. But um, we're gonna go to a tattoo place afterwards so I can get tatted up. I'm not getting anything today, but I'm gonna be having a consultation mm -hmm. with the HMFIC. Yeah, so we're gonna go meet Will's I think Will and Zoe both go to this tattoo girl. Um, but Lance has been wanting to have some work done on his leg for like a leg sleeve. Because I have a shark already. Look, shark shibby, but I want a whole leg sleeve all the way up to my man bits. Mm -hmm. <laughs> man bits. <laughs> um, so we're going to go meet her, and if we like her, then Lance will probably book something. And then I have some tattoos that need some touch ups, and I want some future work done, so maybe I'll do some work with her too. Um, but we will see where that goes. All right, guys. This is Savannah, Hi. Will's beautiful lady friend. What's up, guys? How are we <laughs> and doing? And Will. Guys, we just ate BJ's. We did. And if you have the BJ's near you, you need to stop what you're doing and, and go, go get, get a, the bazooki. Yes. Go get a BJ. Salted caramel bazooki. <laughs> highly recommend. I took a tiny, tiny little bite just to remember what it tastes like. Because it's we'll so good. The whole thing. Yeah, go to yeah, BJ's we'll and, then, and then go to the restaurant, and it's really good. <laughs> But anyway, guys, we are getting back in the truck now. I didn't film anything at the tattoo shop, but whatever. I just promised you that we would see Will and his beautiful friend. So yeah. there they are. Her beautiful friend. <laughs> okay, I'm not good looking. So we had a change of plans. So we originally were going to go to a restaurant downtown for dinner, um, but we were with Will and Savannah and then they left us because we were going to like go our separate ways. Then Will texted us and reminded us that there was bingo tonight. Bingo. Yeah. Bingo was his nibble. Yes, and we love bingo. We are old people. It's actually a lot of fun. It's not like old people bingo. It's like bar bingo. So we're going to go do that. But beforehand, we are going to a restaurant called Cactus Flower, which Lance absolutely loves. I've only been there one time, and I wasn't, like, overly impressed. Because but... she didn't get the right thing. You okay. have to get the enchiladas birdies, so the green enchiladas. And yummy! And then, you, of course, you get sour cream, because how do you not get enchiladas without sour cream? Mm -hmm yummy so you absolutely positively have to do that and there's only one of them in pensacola no two of them actually there's one over by the navy base too yummy yummy enchiladas verdes all the sour cream shibby yeah so we'll see how it goes i'm gonna go ahead and tell you how it's gonna go i'll give you an honest yummy. review yummy you will get an honest review if you me. say it's not yummy there's something wrong with your mouth Bar bingo time. Woo! Excited? Yeah, I'm super excited. Savannah has time. never bingoed. Bingo. 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 No, bingo was a nemo. Let's go. Let's see. Who do you think is going to get bingo? Put it in the comments below. I think like I'm going to have beginner's luck. Yeah, it's going to oh, be dude. her. I had, I had yeah. Last time, I wanted a drink. A water. <laughs> I want yeah. water. They, they, I want a drink, but so I had to give it to one of them because I'm obviously not. We just had Mexican, so he won a water. What? Won. won. <laughs> Just 
All right, guys, so actually, Will and I ended up winning bingo at the same time. And that bingo was rigged. Yeah, it 100% was... was rigged. I, I don't even, mm -hmm. because coincidentally, the girl who was calling the bingo numbers, her parents were there and won four times out of the eight times that they did the bingo thing. And ironically, slash coincidentally, it was on the very last one where everyone had to pay $5 per bingo card and the pot was $135. So get this, Will was one away. He needed like, what was it? Like O61 or Something maybe like G61. That. It was one of the 60, it was 61, whatever it is. I was it's either two zero. away, two away. And of course, her dad, the O67 or whatever it is, her dad called bingo, got up and got $135. And I said, this is bull. That because I think that's absolutely insane that how can your parents call 50% of the bingos? I think it was rigged because I think mm -hmm. what, she had like a, a secret <laughs> or whatever, like some cough or number yeah. or sound or noise. Or, or like whatever. your theory of them going up with the bingo card, like regardless of what the numbers are, they just waited long enough. Yes, because we and then never she got it. like, yeah. Yeah, we never got a picture confirmation yeah. because if she waits long enough and then shouts out a code mm -hmm. word or whatever and says, bingo, her parents walk up to her with the bingo card and say, did I get bingo? And she's like, uh, blah, 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 blah. Yep, yeah. bingo, we got a bingo confirmation. And then it's like, eh, false, yeah. false, false, false. But we never got to see the bingo cards after they were claiming that they won. So I think it's all rigged. Seems like a conflict of interest to me. I concur. But anyway, guys, if you like the video and if you like the vlog on today, thumbs smash up. the thumbs up button. Yes. And subscribe to the channel with bell notifications turned on so you don't miss another fantastic day of me <laughs> about bingo. Yes. And we Hold are on. finishing our day with some outside time for our kitties as we like to give them. Look at my little man. Oh, good. Look at my little man. I don't think he likes me. Oh, yeah. This is the best kitty on earth. He's the best little man. He is. Such a good little boy. And then Bo is... Where'd he go? <laughs> he was over there a second ago. He has a little girlfriend. She's our neighborhood kitty and you guys have seen her maybe if you watch my TikToks. Her name's Tiger. He's She's our outdoor kitty and she is Bo's girlfriend. So. Right, I gotta turn on the lights. You guys haven't gotten a house tour yet because I think people already know where we live. But you're huge hungry. Cause she big. <laughs> Y'all saw the udders. And here's my Zazzy. Oh, Gigi. Zazu, I don't think she's coming today, buddy. It'd be like that. And there's little man. Giggle little man. Oh, buddy. Oh, Gigi. I don't know. Best kitty ever. No, Gigi. Kitty butthole. <laughs> Oh, he's a little man. He kind of looks like me. He's my favorite. All right, love you guys a lot. See you later. Bye.